Oh uh, yeah, people, Camtasia 2023 has arrived and it is packed with all kinds of cool stuff. Today, I'm gonna do a super quick walkthrough of one of my favorite features, and that is something that's called Camtasia filters. So you find Camtasia filters over in the visual effects bin, and if you come up, you'll see there's now two tabs, visual effects and filters. And basically what's in the filters is a bunch of color LUTs that now ship with Camtasia. These are looks, very popular looks, that you can give to images and video, any piece of media, and they're gonna completely change the, the look and feel and tone. Uh, they can make things moody, they can make things um, bright and sunny, and so uh, it's, it's a real quick way to dress things up. So do some color grading, color toning, so I've got a few things to hear down on my timeline. I've got um, just a couple of images. One's a headshot, uh, another one's an outdoor scene. Here's uh, here's some video. So those previous two were images, and uh, we're gonna we're gonna take this one last. We'll see what we're gonna do there. So all right, first things first. Up here, you can see that the thumbnails have a preview of sort of what the colors will do with the classic Camtasia Mountains. And the best thing to do here is really you know, kind of go through here and say, oh, you know what? You know what? Let's find one of these that we like, piercing white. And I'm just going to go ahead and drag that over onto this piece of footage here and uh, actually image. And you can see what's happened over here in the properties panel is it's actually applied a color LUT. So the filters are LUTs that ship with Camtasia and they use the color LUT effect. So now uh, I can see instantly I've changed the way this feels. So I'm going to come up and I'm going to go through and now I can just use the, the quick preview here from that drop down to see all of the LUTs that Camtasia ships with. And as I roll over them, I can see how they preview. So I can, you know, I can get the look that I want here. Uh, maybe, maybe I'm going for just, uh, let's go for like sort of a classic black and white on this one. Yeah, that looks pretty good. All right, another piece of footage. Pretty crazy uh, blown out highlights back here in the background. And there we've got our subject. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna apply the piercing white here to you. So we'll just go ahead and apply the piercing white to it. And you can see all of, all of a sudden, look, look at how she pops out of the image right there. So um, really compelling. And then again, if I wanna quickly preview how this looks with this piece of footage, I can go through, I've got this blue background, you know, maybe I want to go with like this cold punch here, really go with those blue tones and I'll just back the, the filter off a little bit. And there you go. Stylistically, that's something that you'd see on, on the Instagrams, TikToks of the world. All right, we're going to move on. We're going to see that we can do this with footage as well. This time we're going to go ahead and we'll just, we'll apply this effect right here directly to that footage. And there's nothing special about this footage. I've just got a couple of effects applied. I've got a drop shadow and a corner round uh, on this footage. So I've just applied uh, that filter shine down in this particular case. Great band name. I wish someone had the, a band name like that. All right. So here we are. And you can see, all right, I've got that shine down effect on that footage. It's applied in real time. And I can go through and sort of get uh, whatever look I want here. Maybe, maybe we just really, really want to blow out things or go black and white again. You know what? I kind of like this, this sort of matted look right here. Let's, let's go with that on this piece of footage. And you can see now, you know, just like all things in Camtasia, what you see is what you get, drag and drop effects, they preview in real time. All right, now, next thing's next. We're gonna move over to here. And here I've just got uh, an asset from the library. It's just a tablet device. And I'm gonna pop over into my media bin. And actually, I'm in the library there, media bin. And here I've got some, some tablet screen recording. And what I'm gonna do here is, this is a feature that shipped in, uh, in 2022, uh, one of the maintenance uh, releases or minor releases, I'm going to hold and pause, now release, and I'm going to choose ripple replace on this guy. And you can see just like that, now that has been inserted into, into the 
actual device, right? So here we've got that footage. Now we're going to go back to filters because that's what we're talking about. So we'll go to the visual effects and we're in the filters tab. Now I could apply the filter to this entire thing, this asset as a whole. So let's, let's get something that's, uh, that's, uh, we're going to really be able to tell what's happening here. Let's go with the, like the mission to Mars. And if I apply this, you can see when I apply this to this entire group that the filter is actually applying to everything, not just the footage. So I'm, I'm remapping the colors here of everything. So filters are versatile. They can be applied to anything. I'm going to undo that. And what we're going to do though, is actually we just want to apply it to the footage in this particular case. So we're going to, we're going to drill into this guy. Here's that footage. And this time we're going to go, we're going to go apply a hot punch to it on the, on the, on the actual footage down here. Boom. And now let's take a look at what we can do to our screen content. Maybe you want to get sort of stately blue or maybe, maybe warm it up a little bit with this teal and orange or yeah. And so you can see, you can apply these filters to screen footage. Um, I think most of the time you're going to want to apply them to your camera footage, um, your real world footage, your images. Those are those looks that people are really familiar with. Anyways, drag and drop simple, 30 plus. I think there's now 32 LUTs that ship with Camtasia 2023. You don't have to go out and find them. You don't have to go figure out and pay for them. We've got these built-in LUTs that you can just rock on with. So hope you guys enjoy this.